The following portion of Daytime Blue Ridge is sponsored by... Listen to that sizzle. They I love it. Know it. We're back in the daytime kitchen with Jen Litz from FDS Cafe and Spirits, and we're making lamb burgers. Yes, we are. All right. Where are we in the in the process right so now? So these patties might take a little bit. So if I don't get to the point of actually being able to explain it. Right now they're yeah. cooking. Might sure take a little are. bit of time. Well, they're yeah. so big. So They're big. Can you talk a little bit about the difference between lamb meat and others? Um, it, like, does it taste better? Why a lamb burger? It does. Some people think it's a little more on the gamey side, but you're talking like a fraction of what you'd experience with venison or something else. Okay. Um, I find it to be a much leaner meat. Um, I think the smell on it and the flavor on it is unlike lamb. anything else. Yeah. I love lamb too. I, mean, I really yeah. do. So, okay. Yeah. So, we, you know, we don't carry any beef burgers at the restaurant, so I wanted something that was an alternative. I'm wanting to actually start exploring with some bison burgers and stuff like that. Ooh, okay. um, so that's probably coming up next with something we try for burgers, but uh -huh. the lamb just has an incredible flavor. It doesn't need to be topped too complicated. The goat cheese and the Dijon and the spinach really complement the flavor of the actual meat and all the spices we mix into it. So, Do you put like a mint uh, jelly with it or anything no, like that? Wow, Natalie, that is I not know, a bad Natalie, suggestion. where did that come from? I, I I'm, am, a big, I'm a big lamb fan, I'm I, telling you. I know. I, I'm willing to take you on my staff anytime. <laughs> they have they have goat chevre that they put on top. Have you ever heard of that? No, I have not. Put a farm you. on a bun. You've got goat, you've got lamb all on one bun. It's, oh, look it's at the that. entire barnyard. <laughs> all right, so let's just get to doing this. Now. And you said okay. your, your lamb comes from? We get our lamb from our vendor, but our goat cheese actually comes from Curtin's oh, Dairy in Rocky Mount. So oh, okay. it is a local goat cheese. Okay. Get as much local produce as we can. Oh, Look yeah. at that. And then warming the goat cheese is the best part of this. Okay. So kind of steam it for cheese. a That's second. That's what the chevre is. Chevre. Chevre. Uh -huh. Chevre. Chevre. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. Whichever you want to say. Get it? Oh, my oh, God. The puns you. are endless today. Thank you. Thank you right. so, so much. We're going to go ahead and put this on the bun. Oh, it is hot. And then Dijon on the top. I mean, I don't know if people can really tell, but these are some big burgers. Oh, they're, they're huge. huge. I love it. Yeah. They are enormous. Now, is this a, a fairly popular dish? Has it been around for a while? Um, we actually brought it on as a special. It was one of the, I think it was the first special we ever had at the restaurant. Oh. And it went over so well that we just decided to keep it on the menu. And we actually do a lamb slider also. Okay. Oh, okay. So, I, and I don't, people find sliders to be fun. I think sliders are fun. And yeah. I'd, it's, uh, it's good in either fashion. Sure. Yeah. All right. Absolutely. Okay, and it's served up with a little bit of spinach there. Just a little bit, not too much. So uh -huh. then I got mustard on my hand. Okay, and then a side salad. And a side salad, I, I recommend it with the truffle parm fries. I mean, we have a lot of healthy things on our menu, but there are days where you just, that, that is not you all you want to eat. You need some fries. And yeah, if you, you need, need some fries, fries, stop by FPS, seriously. We have really good fries. fries. I'm not going to brag, but we do. We have yeah. good fries. You need to brag about the fries, absolutely. All right. Yeah. And, and about it. the burgers, apparently. Yeah. Okay, and we're going to offer up the recipe on our website, daytimebluridge.com. All you have to do is click on food and look for the lamb burger with Dijon and... Chevre. Chevre. You got Chevre. this. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> in the meantime, order this for yourself at FBS Cafe and Spirits. They're located inside the Patrick Henry. And you can give them a call or go online or Facebook yeah. or whatever Anything. for more information on what you're serving up daily, right? Yep. Yeah, it's always changing. Them. Yeah, no, we change. We have specials every week. We like to offer something new. Yeah. Cool. Thank you All so right. much for coming no in. No problem. Thank you, guys.